Hello everybody and welcome to another video for Python Excel 4. We're going to learn how to automatically, automatically create borders and tables in Excel using OpenPy Excel. I already made three videos on uh, Python Excel. This is the fourth one and then I'm gonna have one more to post. Let's begin by importing modules and the libraries from OpenPy Excel. Uh, I import workbook. If you have, if you don't have OpenPy Excel in your uh, computer, go and do pip install OpenPy Excel. You can do this. If you don't know how to do it, go and see the link below for uh, the tutorial how to do pip install from OpenPy Excel styles import pattern fill border side alignment fold and fit so let's start making uh, our workbook and worksheet this is the way we create workbook make a worksheet active give a title and then make a color to the tab right here so you may want to know what's this color code right here this is the color code uh, and uh, each color like black white red you can find them from here like for the red one it's car index 2 which is gonna be 0 1 2 this is so I'm gonna post this in my uh, github page so and the link is below you can go and see them download them the next thing is we need to define the board borders this is the way uh, we define them so i'm gonna have thin border thick border and double border i already imported the border from here so border the left side of the cell you want it to be dash and this color you can go to the color code to know which color is all are black here uh, and then for right side of the, the cell uh, and then top side and bottom side you know you define you want 10 dash or whatever tick border you have uh, like a left right and top 10 and the bottom medium or like tick i call it tick and then you're gonna have double border for top of your uh, table uh, you want uh, dash it dash it and double and double okay then uh, let's go and make our tables so we can also define if we want to uh, the cells to be filled with different colors and everything so this is the way you're gonna do it pattern fill fill type fills fill the I want it solid and the start color I want to start with this color and finish at the same color you can make it different colors and it, it looks like more uh, prettier if you want to and then I'm gonna define the properties of my uh, tables what I want size of my table I want to 10 by 10 and then the location of the table in the worksheet I want to start from like uh, a1 from and uh, I, I will be able to change it if, if I want to so here it comes how to create the tables I need a for loop okay uh, I'm saying for in a range location of the raw uh, uh, which is one and then I'm saying the row location plus row, row numbers so it's gonna create it uh, how many rows and for the J I'm saying the column location start from there and then uh, plus how many columns we need then I'm gonna format the cell I'm saying uh, this row and this column the cell this one 
the reason I'm adding one because zero is not counted in Excel. So I'm gonna add one to them. And then uh, I want to the border, the cell, and then I'm gonna have border, which is gonna be 10. And then if my the first border, my first row, I, if I am in the first row, which is uh, location of my the, the top location of my row number one here uh, i want it to be double border and also i want it to fill color fill it with this color here blue i guess or yellow uh, so and then uh, i'm saying if at i am at the end of my column my table uh, do a tick border okay and then what I need to do is just save it. And run it to see if it worked. So let's run it. Uh, the delivery is not defined. Oops. Okay, let's run it one more time. Okay. I got it here so here it is I got my table so I have a table this is the title part which is inside the double uh, border and then this is the bottom which is a thick one right here and this is started from the you know B2 you know I wanted to one row here and one column here to be empty and then I have my uh, right side of the column with dashed ones. So it's kind of uh, looks uh, pretty for me. That's what I need. And then I want like tens of them. So how I'm gonna do that? I don't wanna like copy, paste, copy, paste. I want them in a specific location and uh, the same format. I can add, do it very easily. So I'm saying here, I'm going to add here number of tables I want. I want six table and I want the distance between them to be two rows. And then I'm going to have a for loop through this tables. So I'm saying till like number of table make, oh, sorry. Uh, Right. in here go through this loop but I want my uh, locations to be under each other and look pretty how I'm going to do that I just going to update my location my table location it's gonna be right here I'm saying for my row location after making one table go and add the number of the rows of each table plus the distance between them and then uh, by running it i should have six tables under each other right okay let me run it and see what i got okay yes you see how many tables I got very easily so you can play with them you want like the number of uh, in your table by five by six you want it start from three and three and you want ten of them for example run it Make it smaller and many of them so you can easily do this for uh, any other type of tables just uh, I guess I forgot one thing right here so for the styles border styles we have dash one we have double and we have some other ones that I gonna post in my github uh, 
account please see the link below with that thank you very much for watching and please do not forget to subscribe have a good day bye bye